What's going on everyone? So today I'm going to show you how to remove um, the diff in my Arma Typhon 4S. Um, it applies for any of the 3S models do. I just upgraded it to 4S. So I'm going to show you how to pull that diff out and get to that. So let's get right into it. Alright, so the first thing you want to start by doing is getting your hex wrench out. This is a 2mm. You want to remove the shock, um, the links, and then there's some stuff beneath. That's the screw right there. Alright, so we got all those screws removed and stuff. We're just going to take um, the car and flip it over. So it is going to be quite dirty for sure, but um, we want to switch it to a 1.5. We're going to remove these four screws here, and then there's one on the back right here that attaches the bumper and stuff, and that's a 2 millimeter. Alright, and then this is the cool part. You will want to flip it back over like that. And this is where. Oops, I totally forgot. So, you got all that stuff underneath, and then you just gotta remove uh, the um, transmission. Totally forgot about that, so we're gonna go through a procedure. If you um, forgot how to do that, go check the link. I'll put a link in the description below. And I got a video on how to get the trans and the, all the drive shaft. Alright, so got the transmission out. And now you just pull this. You gotta watch out for those little pivot balls. Luckily, I got more of those on the way. And this whole piece right here comes apart, which is great. Um, so then this pops out, this just goes in like that, and I can look at the diff, because I was having stripping issues with this gear, which is right, it's hard to, hard to see it, but it's down in there, it's the ring gear, um, it's the ring gear, pinion gear, anyways, I'll show you how to just take this apart, screw on this side, and a screw on that side, so we'll take that out. And then, this is the hard part, you know. I kind of want to have gloves on here for this. These two pieces just slide apart here. You can actually twist them apart, that's what I do. And then, boom, your little ring gear, I mean pinning gear, comes apart, comes off, oops. Uh, bearings on it, just like that. And then you got your diff gear, which this has been fine, um, and then it, these do pull all the way off the drive shafts, but I haven't been able to do that before. So super easy to do, um, the maintenance is really easy on it, I just like how easy it is to, you know, boom, your diff's pulled apart, you can mess with the fluids inside, I just keep stripping these. I don't know why I keep stripping up, so I'm going to probably upgrade to metal. Um, hope you enjoyed it. Hope it was helpful, and we will catch you in the next one. Thanks, guys. See ya.